Hi, my name is Sarah Clark and I am one of the educational planners here at South Puget Sound Community College in the advising department. And I am here to let you know that we are still here to support you throughout this time. For example, we are still providing appointments which are available via Zoom, video conferencing, or phone only. To schedule an appointment, you'll log into Compass as usual and be able to select your educational planner or financial aid advisor, look at their schedule, and schedule an appointment. For important updates, be sure to be checking your spscc.edu email daily. That is where important communications from your advisor, student services, and the campus will come and be available to you. If you have other quick questions for advising, please feel free to email us at advising at spscc.edu, and we look forward to continuing to help you. Hi, I'm Ross, and this is Sally. Together, we're your counseling service. Uh, we wanted to just acknowledge that this is kind of a stressful time for folks. Many folk, folks are worried about the coronavirus. There's a lot of uncertainty around that, which can lead to worry. People are having to make a bunch of major changes in their life, switch to online classes, uh, deal with childcare in a different way, so on and so forth. Uh, so we wanted to let you know that we're here for you during this difficult time. And the ways that we're here for you right now, because many of you uh, might not be coming to campus, is we're available for uh, video, live uh, counseling sessions. We're also available by phone, and then additionally by email. Uh, so even from a distance, we're here for you to support you. Please be checking the Counseling Services page on the SPSCC website to get the most current information about how to schedule appointments with us and perhaps even do walk-ins. Take good care. Hi, I'm Carrie. I'm the Curriculum Designer and I work in the Center for Teaching and Online Learning and just want to reassure students that even though we aren't going to be physically together on campus, there's still lots of ways that you can get help. Um, you can access us by phone, by email, and we're adding a Zoom option this, this quarter. Uh, additionally, for spring quarter, we're going to have an evening Zoom option. So even if you're doing your work at night, we'll have somebody available to answer questions. You can email us, you can call us. Um, we also have the Learning at SPSCC on Canvas. We have a CTAL website that we'll make sure that you all have access to. And if you run into any trouble, we're here to help you no matter what. Hi, my name is Margaret Thomas. I'm one of the librarians at the college. And the best way to contact us for help this quarter is to go to the Get Help link on our website. And there, in addition to our phone number, you'll find an email address, and maybe best of all, you'll find a link to a chat service that is uh, open 24 seven. So you can talk to a live librarian. And remember that you can do a lot of your research from home through the library. Library. We have a large collection of electronic books and streaming videos and all of our databases are accessible from home using your SPSCC email and address. So just let us know if you get stuck. We're here to help. Hello everyone. My name is Robert Lane and I serve as the Director of Student Life here at South Puget Sound Community College. I wanted to take a moment to give you an update about our food pantry on campus. When our campus is open, so are we. Although our hours and days of operations may change, I'd encourage you to check the website for any up-to-date information. In addition to our food, we also have hygiene products as well as children's books for those in need. For some preventive measures, we're moving away from our shopping model and moving to a pre-bagged option. This will limit exposure and keep all of our community members safe. We'll also be having anyone that's entering in the food pantry wash their hands prior to coming in and limit the amount of individuals that come in at a time. Thank you so much for taking the opportunity to still continue to use our, utilize our resources and view us as a resource for you.